Good morning. We're out in the desert and um, we're going to do a session of Qigong. So um, just invite you now to allow yourselves to stand uh, with your feet together and feel the connection with the earth. So feel your feet grounded into the sand or the lawn or the floor wherever you are and feel that connection with the planet as if there is a waterfall of energy going down from the root of your spine all the way down to the core of the earth and just feel grounded in your body feel the weight of the gravity of the planet And then shifting our focus to the crown of our head and having our awareness go out above us, seeing ourselves above us, expanding that awareness to the immediate area around you, up towards the buildings that are around you in the city, the neighborhood. So you see your whole city below you and your awareness is in every part of that city going up all the way to the sky and the clouds the outer atmosphere and then traveling faster than the speed of light in every direction where your awareness is now in every corner of the universe Then bring your awareness now to your body, our presence here on the planet, our experience of everyday living, simultaneously connected to the gravity of the earth and also our untapped potential with the heavens above us. And it's in that space that we live. Now I'm going to invite us to explore the what's known as the three treasures in Qigong and that's um, body, breath, and mind. So the body, the posture, we're going to be mindful right now and just tuck our sacrum in a little bit. Inhaling zipping up our spine, our head up, our chin back, our shoulders drop, our hands soft. Taking our space. And then shifting our awareness to the second treasure, which is our breath. So allowing ourselves to breathe naturally, slowly and naturally. And now with one hand, we're pouring out the regrets of the past as we bring it up to prayer position and with the other we pour out the anxiety of the future and where they fuse together is the present moment and this will be the focus of our practice today. So with that go ahead and inhale float your arms up and then step to the side exhaling down floating the arms down inhale up, exhale down, inhale, you can roll up to the balls of your feet as if you're going to take off and then exhale down, land on your ankles. Make sure you have a firm footing there that's supporting you, however that might be.
and then just begin our shaking which is basically pumping our ankles letting our body shake <laughs> letting all the energy and the chi flow through our meridians and then start bouncing if you want while you shake bringing your hands up above your head to the side and behind you and just move in a way that feels good for you releasing any tension allowing the energy to freely flow breathing naturally And then shimming from side to side. <sighs> Letting go of that practice, just allow yourself to now embrace every sensation, embrace every feeling, noticing any shifts in energy. And then just allow ourselves to take a wider than shoulder stance. And we're going to do what's known as knocking on the door of life. So we make our hands like soft fists and we can hit the upper corner of our chest. And the back of our hands are, are hitting about two inches below the navel on our back. That's called the door of life. Our hands are activating chi points along our lungs in this corner between our chest and our shoulder. And releasing that and seeing if you feel a difference where you've actually activated a chi there. I'm going to start off with a breathing, big breath, moving our hands out as we inhale and then exhale, bringing them together. Allow yourself to move with that if you like. We're going to now start rotating our hands as we breathe naturally, called churning the chi. And so we're just as if we have some symbols in our hands that we're going through in a circle. And move in a slow manner, a gentle manner. Breathe long, smooth, and deep breaths. And when our focus is with our movement and our breath, um, our mind is typically in the present moment. So keeping a present moment focus with this movement, the slow, deliberate movements, the long, smooth, and deep breathing. Practice. 
present mind focus and reversing direction of your your churning of the chi. Switch our plates so that they're horizontal. Flipping our hands over and then doing it on the other side. Long, smooth, and deep breaths, and gentle and deliberate movements. Releasing this process, we're going to now do Immortals Moving Stone. So, what we're going to do now is push one hand out as we exhale. Inhale, and then switch hands. As if you're pushing a big stone that's maybe in a wall. Again, long, smooth, and deep breaths. Gentle, deliberate movements. And in this way, with this mental focus, we create this elixir of health. So the purpose of Qigong is to create more Qi, which is the vital essence that runs through our body. That vital essence that allows us to overcome stress. It's like an elixir, a medicine that only we can make. At least this practice. We're going to now do um, Buddha holding up the sky, inhaling our hands, and then when it comes to shoulder level, we push it out. And just stay there and breathe deeply three times into your tummy. Last breath, bring the hands down. Inhale. Exhale up and breathe deeply three times. Fingers facing, palms up. Now we're going to bring one hand up to the sky, palms up, and the other palms down to the ground. And the backs of the palms should be uh, somewhat aligned. And we're going to breathe deeply three times into our bellies. Switch hands. Breathe deeply three times. Now 
Then allow yourself to move with your breath. Dividing heaven and earth is what we're doing in this movement. Releasing that process, just take this moment to feel the subtle energies of the earth and notice how you feel within. If there's been any shifts in energy for you. Inhaling, we're going to raise our hands up to our chest, above our chest. Expanding our chest up to the sky, completely opening up and stretching out our spine as we inhale. And then when we exhale, we're going to round our shoulders and tuck our tail, bringing our fists together, exhaling, inhaling, opening up, exhaling, closing. Inhale, open, stretch, exhale, round the spine, tuck the tail, exhale, close. A big pump of chi, that vital resource that flows throughout us, bringing vitality and energy. As we exhale, letting go of things that no longer serve us. Opening up to all new possibilities. Exhaling, letting go of fatigue and depletion. Opening up with health and vitality. Taking in the chi of the earth and sky. Releasing that no, no longer serves us into the ground to be recycled into the earth. And let go of that practice. Inhaling, bringing our hands up to shoulder level like a bird and exhaling. Floating your hands back down. Inhaling. Floating up, exhaling, floating down. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Inhale, bringing up the hands up to shoulder level and exhale, pushing out. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Deliberate and gentle movements. Long, slow and deep breathing. Bring your hands now to our chest and pushing them out in front of us. <clears throat> Setting our limits in life, setting our boundaries,
valuing ourselves and floating our hands back down to the ground and seeing how we feel. We're going to do now one called Shooting Arrow and we'll make a broad horse stance and with our hands we're going to cross them and then we're going to exhale and open as if we're opening up a pulling on a, a bow, an arrow. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, we can take a step with this if we like. Exhale, inhale, exhale. Of course, always moving to your own breath and our biomechanics vary. Releasing that practice, taking a moment to reflect and see how you feel. Embracing all feelings. We can even sift through our energy field by lifting our hands up, palms up as we inhale. Exhale, sifting and feeling ourselves in our energy field and see how that conversation with ourselves as we sift we inquire and we notice any feeling any emotion how do your fe feet feel right now how's your back feeling any aches anywhere are you feeling good inside physically? Are you emotionally, are you sad or angry or joyful? And whatever that feeling might be, just acknowledge it. and sit with that emotion or that physical feeling and move your consciousness to the middle of that feeling wherever that might be in your body as if your whole mental awareness and body awareness is not centered like up in the head but it's centered in that body part with that emotion. Breathing into that emotion or feeling in the body with every breath, expanding your awareness of that feeling, acknowledging, embracing completely So go ahead and bring your arms up to shoulder level if you're flapping like a bird and then exhale bringing your feet together <clears throat> bring your hands together in prayer position <coughs> and just acknowledge your feelings today. Thank yourself for being in this practice.
and with gratitude of all that we have, all of our blessings. Think of a blessing you'd like for yourself and plant that blessing, that intention within your heart right now. Smile down with a beautiful rays of positivity within your body. Smile down on all the organs and cells and tissues in your body. Inhale and manifest that blessing in the world, letting it bloom. Exhaling down, joining the back of the hands together, bringing your hands up and flipping them out like you're providing this blessing, offering this blessing to the world, giving the very best of yourself to yourself and the world. With one hand make into the fist, the other into the palm. The fist being power, representing power, and the palm representing love. Wrap your palm around your fist. And we like to embrace our power with our love. And with that, I want to thank you today be out with me here in the beautiful desert and have a wonderful day and may you experience all your blessings. Thank you.